Action. <laughs> hey, what's going on? This is Stefan James, and this is my Variety Cover Shoot. I started doing off like like small TV roles in, in Canada, and of course you got you got paid a little bit. But then when I started to get movies and started to come over to LA, I mean, I guess you you really got to see how you know hard work you know really does pay off. Literally, pays off. I'm grateful for everything. I think that it's it's one of those things where you don't do it for the money, but um, it's a beautiful thing to be able to take care of yourself, take care of your family, and um, and have fun while you're doing it. The most valuable lesson that I've learned is probably just patience, I think. You know, patience in your work environment. Meryl Streep said that, you know, we, we get paid to wait, the acting we do for free, and that's pretty much what it is. I think that the toughest lesson that most young artists sort of have to learn is that not everything's gonna happen sort of when you want it to happen, and realize that not everything's for you, and what is for you can never be taken away from you. I think when I was younger, I think I was a little bit more emotionally attached to projects or potential prospective projects than I, than I am now. You know, sort of just realizing that, you know, you can put so much into something and really realizing that it's not up to you. You know, as an actor, we can only do so much, um, you know, but there's so many other elements that have to fall into place in order for us to get that dream job that we want. And so I've just come to, to terms with the fact that it's not up to me. If I go in a room and I do my job, or if I go, you know, on self-tape and do my job, and that's all I can, you know, that's all I can do. You ready for this? I've never been more ready for anything in my whole life. I want to look around and see a thousand, you know, black leading young men, you know, guys like me who are, who are doing it every day. You know, there doesn't just have to be one of us or five of us, you know, there can be a thousand of us. I think we're definitely making strides. We're definitely making strides, but honestly, I can just say that I'm proud to, to be a part of this group that's making the change. And we can all share in each other's work and celebrate each other's work and uplift each other. And I think tell diverse stories, you know, not just black stories, but, you know, great stories that just happen to feature black artists, which is, which is even more important. Nice escape. I thought I had you there. That's what I wanted you to think. You want to do Degrassi at least, at least once. And so I had my face for a couple of seasons and just being really, really excited. It was one of those shows that I was genuinely a fan of as a kid. I say it's a lot, it's like a Canadian rite of passage for, for young actors growing up in Toronto. We got a few, we got a few of us um, out here doing really, really cool things. I mean, shout out to my brother, first of all, Shamir Anderson, who's an actor from Toronto. Lamar Johnson, um, Mena Masood, who just did the, the Aladdin movie. So many great, great uh, storytellers that come from Canada and Toronto specifically. Get together, eat Canadian bacon, maple syrup, all that. And yeah, again, just happy to be a part of the whole, uh, I guess what we call the Hollywood North.